eyeliner and where do you normally I put my eyeliner most of the time on the bottom my waterline and on the top and where do you normally put yours uh, the same okay I usually use it all right top so and I'm gonna d tell you to look down and you just lightly do it and you just kind of go along your uh, eyelash line I'm gonna do the same for the other eye Okay, open. Okay, close again. Relax. I'm just making it to where I can see it really good. Eyeliner makes your eyes pop. It makes you like eye, it like lines your eye, and it makes you have a little bit of more color. I'm gonna do a little bit on her bottom. Try not to make her cry. <laughs> um. What's your favorite makeup product we have on? I like the mascara. Yeah. And I like the the um, primer. And I like the powder. Mm -hmm. And mask. Uh, I've already said mascara. Concealer. And the concealer. Yeah, I like the concealer. And that's pretty much all I use. I don't use really a lot. Okay, and so now um, we I use mascara to after this after we do the eyeliner and the um, eyeshadow and everything. And I put my eyeliner on the bottom lashes and the top lashes. And while she's doing that, I'll talk a little bit about. Uh, um, I'm, I'm going to talk a little bit about uh, all the other products I have over here. So this is we have over 400 products in Arbonne. This is just a few. This is a makeup set and a skincare set. But we have over 400 products. And this is a glow stick for all the younger girls. I don't know who contours their face or everything, but. This is like a contour brush and a highlight stick. And so on one side it's highlight. And if you don't know what highlight is, it kind of just like gives you a glow. And that's kind of the style. It's like a shimmer in a way. But this one's very light. It's nothing like crazy. And then contour is kind of like when you contour your face, it kind of gives you like a shape and all that kind of stuff. I haven't quite figured that out yet, but I think it's super fun to try and do that. Um... And then I said the primer, this also helps you, like, gives you, like, a coat on your face to help spread your uh, foundation and help you use less. And then we talked about this foundation. And this is the one I normally use. And there's a shade for everybody. This is natural beige. And this is the one for my summer color because I'm darker in the summer. And then I'll use this on her in a minute. And this is the finishing spray. It's called the refreshing spray, but it's the finishing spray as well. And this is kind of like to set your makeup. And I use it after I finish, and it just kind of, it's like a mist. And it feels like it's going to get your skin wet, but it's fine. It's going to set your makeup, and it's going to look good. And then this is a concealer. We talked about it. This is one of her favorites. And it looks really good and help. it blends well, and it covers very well. And then we also have over... I think there's over eight or nine or ten blushes. These are just a few that are my favorites. And one is like a darker pink, and this is called Blush. That's funny. And then this one is called uh, Blossom, and it's very, very, very pretty. It's more of a nude, too. Okay, so I'm going to lightly spray her face. Don't blink too hard. And it's just going to set our makeup, and it's just a mist, so it's fine. And then next, we, I absolutely love all of the lipsticks. Um, the first thing I do every time is I do a lip liner, or I, uh, if I don't have my lip liner, I won't use anything. But the lip liner kind of helps you line your lip to help you know, like, keep your lipstick in the lines. Um, not everybody uses it, but I use it sometimes. But uh, I'm probably not going to use this on her because I'm going to use a different color. Um, but we have two, a few of my favorite colors of the lipsticks are um, Lotus. This is a darker, like, nude color. Rosé is a nude color. Aster is like a kind of a maroonish, like, dark color. And then a very, very, very popular one is Orchid, and that's what I'm going to use on her. I've probably given my friend, every single one of my friends, this color. 
it's beautiful it's pink and it has gold sparkles in it it's not like a super hot pink but it's like a nude pink you probably can't tell in my hand but it's really really pretty and it's a it's probably the most sold and so i'm gonna put this i'm gonna let you do it because <laughs> i don't want to mess up but um this is one of her favorite colors too and i love that color it's a pink we have nude, we have reds, we have browns, we have all the colors that you have. I own all of the lipstick colors and I absolutely love them. Um, and I also use the lip gloss as well. This is my favorite lip gloss and it's called Mallow. And it's just like a nude lip gloss. Do you want any lip gloss or you find You put it on there if you want. Okay. And this is, lip gloss is just to apply after. It's like a gloss to give you something to roll your lips so it's not so like dry on your lip. And then also we have the regular sticks and then these are my two favorite lip liners. This one is called Tulip and this one is called, I can't find the name, oh Tulip and Posy. Posy is the pink and Tulip is like the more darker, for the darker colors. And then we also have these two sided lipsticks. This part is the lip lipstick and it's kind of like a matte color matte means it's not as like glossy and then you have the glip gloss on the other side and this is one of my favorites and this one is called petunia and then this one is called azula and this one's a darker color and it has like a bronzy gold lip gloss that goes with it but other than that that's about all i have to say about the makeup and i use it every single day i use it whenever I can and I absolutely love it. It doesn't make my face oily. It's organic, it's natural, and it's plant-based and that's why I love it so much and it makes me feel so good about my skin and doesn't break me out. And the, the skincare along with the makeup, um, uh, it does not cause your face to be oily. Um, it, it does not have petroleum in it. Um, Petroleum is what a lot of the skincare has in it, that, and it just sits on top of your skin. Uh, with our skincare line, um, the skincare actually is a, absorbed into your skin instead of sitting on top of your skin because the petroleum is not absorbed into your skin. The makeup the same way. The makeup uh, does not have petroleum in it, um, and it does not cause your face to be oily. As you can tell, her skin complexion is really good. Me, fortunate, I've been blessed with good, a good complexion, but the products, um, they, say, they do what they say they're gonna do and they're actually good for you. And the everything lasts is a great, it lasts a long time. I probably could have found this foundation for over three, four, or five months. Like, it lasts so long. And the, and the main thing with helping the makeup last long is the primer and she has this uh, another thing it's an oil it's like an it's, it's like a it's like an essential oil, not an essential oil but it's like an oil you can put on your skin and it helps spread your makeup i don't have it right now but it's it's along with one of the skincare lines and i find that it helps it helps moisturize your skin and also helps uh spread your foundation and i love that too but i'll have to show that in a different video and it's awesome mm -hmm. thank you for watching